One of my followers just sent this to me. This is a live update on Hurricane Dorian, apparently from a reliable source. Now I'm going to be moving over to show you the speed that's at. Let's take a look at that. Right there on the outside, 73 mile per hour winds. Notice the date here. The date coming at September the 1st. It should say, here it is. Right there, the date. 9-1-2019, okay? Let's check this out. 62 mile per hour winds. It's over. This is where its location is right now, right over the Bahamas. I was watching the Weather Channel, and they were they're claiming it's 185 miles per hour, and I didn't. And they showed a, a video, a live video of a palm tree, and it was standing straight up. If the winds were really 185 miles per hour, that palm tree would be bending over, and its roots would be coming out of the ground. So they're just lying to you. Look at this. Look at it. I don't see it. the 56 miles per This is the actual strength of the hurricane from a live feed. On September the 1st, right now at 4.44 p.m. Here are the actual temperatures. Look at that. 100. Now here's where you're getting a little bit higher. I don't see 180. Oops, excuse me. There's 106. It looks to be... Category of very wow, it's almost like a category two. I don't know what 106 is. These are your strongest winds right here. Let's get close to the eye. It's weakening. This is a live feed. I will have a link to this underneath this video. This is a live feed of the hurricane from a more reliable source than um look at the date right here. The date, okay, okay, I don't see 185 here anywhere, I'm moving my, look at this, they're lying to you folks, they're lying to you, I'm giving you the evidence right here, this is an actual live feed of the hurricane, over the Bahamas right now, I don't see 185 there anywhere, they're lying to you. I want to thank my uh, YouTube commentator who gave me this link. Now let's go over to the television set. Let's go on to the Weather Channel. The Weather Channel. Let's see. The Weather Channel's lying, man. Look at that. The Weather Channel. They're saying it's 185 degrees, okay? Now you come right over here and look at this. This is a live feed. I don't see it, folks. Where's 185? Hmm. Something's not, something smells rotten in Denmark here, you guys. Okay, the time now is 5.01 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here in Florida. I live in Brevard County, Florida. No more than 10 minutes from the Atlantic Ocean. And it's September the 1st. Okay, this is Hurricane Dorian right now, live over the Bahamas. And um, it's the wind gusts in the past hour. Okay, let's check this out. 80... Four mile per hour winds here. It's the winds are strongest right about here. 85, 91, 105. These are the gusts. The darker colors, the dark purple, are stronger winds. You see that? So the strongest winds are right here. Um, it's certainly not 185. Let's kind of go back and let you look, look at the big picture. Let's check out wind speed. 10 meters above ground. Okay. It's even weaker when you get um, 10 meters above ground. So it's about 74. This is the actual wind speed of Dorian. Oh, you can see the Bahama Islands. Um, pray for the people in the Bahamas. Even though this isn't the Category 5 monster. Now, now let's get over here. 
and uh, look at what the Weather Channel's saying. I mean, this is crazy. Some large ones that are inhabited, and then this right here that is Grand Bahama Island, where Freeport is. That'll be next in line. Oh, look at that! Again, when you're moving along at just five miles per hour, we are going to be oh in the thick of this God, for a very long time. Oh my God! Are they lying to us? In the Bahamas, and I fear that hey, they are lying to us. And I get, I, 185, I get this sense that no from way, going no way, that people man. In the Bahamas refer to yeah, it looks like you can't trust the these people. And then after the hurricane, he just kind of had that moment in time, and this may be their moment in time. Oh, bunch of liars! Still forecast by tomorrow. Oh my God! To be intense, 165 I don't think we can trust these the people, five, folks. Uh, at that time. Okay. Going, Tuesday, going back, back to the live feed. The Here's the live feed. Uh, category two strength here. It's an incredible storm. Okay, they're it's saying it's 185. Really? Where is it 185? It doesn't matter when it comes to hurricanes. There's no 185 here. Almost. There's 70. That's the wind speed. Let's go back down to the gusts. These are the stronger ones. In the past hour. This is it. Uh, I mean, this is what you would see. It is hundred and circular here. It's about a hundred and uh, some of the gusts are going up to a hundred and four, hundred and fourteen. About forty-five miles. The hurricane. This is in the past hour. In essence, about a ninety-mile wide. Oh, what a liar they are. You know why they're lying to you, folks? You know why they're lying to you? Because they want you to stop doing the Gale Commandments. Look at that. You say, why would they lie to you? Because when you do the Gale Commandments, when you do the Gale Commandments, I'm going to turn him off, liar. When you do the Gale Commandments, it strengthens my Gale shield. Okay, right there, right there. That's the that is. I'll have a link for that underneath this video. I just wanted to show you that they are lying, because here is an actual live feed of the hurricane. I don't see 185 here. 117. That's the wind gusts, not the wind speed. They, in other words, the gusts tended. These are the gusts. 102. It's still pray for the Bahamas, you know, and they're probably losing power and stuff. So, um, yeah, as you can see, uh, apparently what I'm hearing brain to brain from Brent Spiner is accurate. That, um, it's a, he said it was a weak category four. Actually, uh, looks like it's gone down to three and a weakening. That's what he told me uh, about eight hours ago. So here it is. You keep doing the Gale Commandments, as you can see. Uh, it uh, looks like we got 110 is the max right now. I'm not sure what category that is, but it's certainly not a Category 5. Um, I think it would be a Category 3. Maybe, a, yeah, I think it's a 3. But just keep doing the Gale Commandments. The news media is lying to you. Here is the here are the actual wind gusts right here. Lori McBride is getting desperate. This is right over the Bahamas. They need to update their uh, mile per hour readings. See, look, um, this is the actual live feed of the hurricane. Right there, I don't see 185 anywhere. Somebody's lying to us.